back to my channel and my red cheeks. I'm not sure why they're so red right now. Just ignore that, please. Today, we are doing the Husband Picks My Makeup Challenge. I am so excited. Mike has never been on my channel before, like fully on my channel. I feel like he's made like an appearance one or two times in older videos. And then I may have popped up pictures here and there of the two of us, but he's never like been on my channel. And I am super, super excited to see what he picks out, you guys, he knows nothing about makeup. So we'll see how this goes, but I'm gonna show you him picking my makeup, shopping my stash, if you will, and then I'm going to apply all of the goodies that he chose, and then we're gonna do the final reveal, and I'll bring him back in and show him the makeup look that I created with his choices. Before we get started, don't forget I'm uploading every single solitary day this month. I'm super, super excited about that. If you like this video while you're watching it, please go ahead and give it a big thumbs up. It really does help my channel out, and other than that, if you're excited and you want to see what makeup look I create with whatever makeup my husband chooses for me, then let's go ahead and get started. All right, guys. So this is Mike. Say hello. Hello. We've never filmed together. So if we're real giggly, <laughs> just ignore it. Also, we have Kitty here too. We got the whole family here today. I'm excited. All right, sir. You have to pick me a whole face of makeup. Are you prepared? Are you nervous? Not at all. I'm not prepared. <laughs> You're not prepared at all. Yeah. You don't know, you don't know much about makeup, which is I'm fine. I'm just hoping I get one of everything you actually need i hope so too yes. because i really don't want to have to help you and cheat so but like i might just in these drawers yeah maybe? okay so a bunch of stuff <laughs> is in here and then i also have makeup in here that like drawer right there but then most of my eyeshadow palettes are like all right there in those containers and there's a couple up there as well you can you feel free babe you pick whatever the heck you want whatever your heart desires <laughs> well i guess we start here yeah that works so i don't know what any of these are okay I think we start easy, like an eyeshadow palette. Okay, you can pick an eyeshadow palette first. I feel like I'm at a store. <laughs> That's how much makeup I have? I know, it's it's a lot. This one looks cool. Ooh, you like that one? That's a Pat McGrath. You yeah, you just gotta, it's hard to open, you're right. Oop. Oop. <laughs> I know, it's hard to open, that happens to me too. What do you think about that one? They look like colors. They, yeah. <laughs> I mean, I guess I gotta get a couple, and then I'll see if I can tell any difference. You can do that. I Ooh. should have known I hear this being mentioned often. Yes, one of my faves. Oh, these don't have any colors. We don't want that. Oh, we, we don't want color. Colors. You like color? Yeah, it's Christmas time. Right? Good to know. Do you want me to do a Christmassy look? I guess we'll for anyone. <laughs> it doesn't How many happen. do you need? Do you just need, like, one? You need just one. Yeah. I mean, you yeah. can pick more if you want, but normally just one. Oh, gosh. That's in the way back. Oh, okay. Yeah, that one's pretty. But it's all shimmer, so like, just oh, let you know. Is, is that a bad thing? Uh, I, I guess I can't tell you. <laughs> I feel like I'm gonna definitely cheat this whole time. <laughs> I feel like I'm definitely gonna cheat on accident. Oh Are you checking out these? Cool. Okay, you can check those out. Books. Yeah. Oh, oh. Those are from Anastasia Beverly Hills. Oh, of course. <laughs> you knew that. <laughs> oh. I don't think what's the difference. Oh, like, there's, 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 oh. there's differences, I promise. I don't know. <laughs> this one. This one uh, I like the one here I got. I'm okay. Go with Stick with that one. You can put, yeah, I'll, I'll fix those. You're good. Alrighty, so we got this eyeshadow palette. Very pretty. It's actually one of my favorites. Good job. Yeah, it's cool. So you picked it because of packaging? Yes. That sounds right, yep. And it's got multiple colors, so, mm -hmm. you know, lots of selection. So I'm going to go up. Um, you don't have to go up there. I mean, that stuff's like stuff I don't really use very often. Lipsticks. Um, they're all like right here. If you want to pick a lipstick, right there. Oh, now you're cheating. Now I know where they are. Well, honey, <laughs> you can tell those are lipsticks. Mm. Oh lord. <laughs> so like, I mean, I just think like a normal red one, right? Like. Oh, red. Okay. You like red lips? I don't know. That's what the normal lipstick color is. Right? I also have some down here. <laughs> I'm gonna give you like too many options. I also have some this down one, there. This one looks bright and bold. Mm-hmm. What's this from? Color I think ColourPop. Pop. I'm trying to hold the camera still, guys, but I don't know how good I'm doing. So sorry. This one looks cool. They're all the same. Like, what the? <laughs> let's, let's compare. <laughs> oh, wait, wait. They are different shit. That's pretty I told different. you. See? Thank you, sir. Let's see if I can find like, why do you think I have, one. Why do you think I have to have 20 of them? Because they're all different. How are you even find Kitty, you why are you doing that on my carpet? Please stop doing that. Silly. This one looks Christmas color. Okay, so. let's do that one. I got two. These are the easy ones. Now yeah. I gotta figure out. I need like a blush. Mm -hmm. Some, I need a little eye stuff. You got, what eye stuff? I don't know. 
This is eye stuff. No, I mean like, I don't know, like the, the wing stuff you put. Oh, eyeliner. Yeah. Mascara. What are these called again? Foundation. Oh, yeah. oh okay. I guess I'm getting all the hints today. Uh, it's okay. You know, it's just your first time. Your first time. I can give you hints. You have one color here. So well, I have one. I have one skin tone. Yeah. <laughs> I should have one color of foundation. Just pick whatever one you like the best. Bobby, which one do you want? Oh, he's like, I'm out. I'm out. <laughs> you ran away. <laughs> Look at this one. This one looks like. Oh, why are you going in the back? What is this? That's not even foundation. Look at that color. Stop it. It's, like it's, moldy. it's a. It's not mold. It's a bronzer drop. You just have to shake it up. Well, then, I mean, I, we'll, we'll go with we'll, we'll, we'll a little baby one. Like, there's no way. This has got to be perfect. It's, oh, this is what they do. In the Are you going to swatch? Oh, oh, him swatching? Looks, what do you think about that? Looks like paint. <laughs> it is. It's paint for your face, I mean, it's essentially. So small. I feel like you, you would be pissed if I chose <laughs> Ooh, this one. This one's never been used. That's not true. It has been used. But, um, all right. Um, Believe um, Beauty. Oh, that's a drugstore one. That's like five bucks. Heck, yeah. Okay. So what else we got in here? These are powders. I, I got it. I got okay, it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'll help you. What are these used for? Let's see here. S they Setting powders. Yeah. So oh, like, good job, babe. Well, I read the, the label. Oh, <laughs> that's an eyeshadow palette. You already have an eyeshadow palette. How do you know what all these are? How because I just crap? know. I just know. Eyeshadow. This looks like an eyeshadow. It's palette. actually a powder. <laughs> well, let's grab one of these. This this is a big one. It's got color things. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It looks like it's a different shade though. So. This one's empty. Like, it's, maybe... It comes out of the hole. It's not empty. Like, shake it up. Yeah. This is what he does the whole time I have him in here while I'm filming. This is why I can't have my cat in here. Oh yeah, we're gonna go with that one. Perfect. Cool, okay, nice. Christmas thing, you know? <laughs> is this your whole, your whole aesthetic is Christmas themed? Right, I need something, otherwise this is gonna Can be I shut random. this? Yeah. Okay, thanks. Okay, there's a lot of stuff in this drawer. There's brow products and mascaras and highlights. So you get to pick. Are those all the same things? <laughs> no. <laughs> Let's see what this is. This looks like, I'm guessing, something you put on your eyebrows. <laughs> oh, there you go. <laughs> Ink. That's what you put on your face? Okay, you're going with that mascara? Oh. Oh, is, it, is that what that is? Oh, yeah. I probably shouldn't have said that. Sorry. Look at this one. Yeah. What do you think about that False one? False lash effect. Is Ooh. that what we're going for? What's this one going? You it's choose. got nothing going for it. Just half caked. These are all, these are literally all the same. There's no way you can tell the difference between these. <laughs> it's just about how they perform on your lashes. Okay, cool. Yeah. I like it. Perfect. Let's grab one of these things. Yep, that's highlight. Where's God? This is just what he does. Okay, now what's yeah. the difference between this uh -huh. and this? Well, this sets your face, like sets it down, and then the highlight gives you like shine, like on my cheeks. You know how I have like shine on my cheeks? That's what the highlight does. So this is like your primer? No, you haven't picked a primer yet. <laughs> Wait, that, oh, that's an actual thing? I'll yeah, that's, talking, a, no, that's an actual thing. Yep, that's an actual thing. You haven't picked one yet. You picking that one? Go with that. Okay, I like I mean, it. Does this look like that's, this? that's also a highlight. Oh, this is Jacqueline's. <laughs> you know Jacqueline? That's highlight. How do you know? What do you mean, how do I know? Look at it. It's so, like, bright and shiny. Yeah. <laughs> Butterscotch. Stop it, silly boy. All right. Now you're on blush. Okay. Rosy cheek stuff, right? You rosy cheek this. stuff, yes. You don't have any. What are you talking I have so much blush. I actually did just do a blush declutter, though. Oh, I got rid of a bunch. Let's see if I can... We'll, we'll get three out. Okay. That we'll sounds like a plan. three random looking... Thing. Like, how is this a blush? Open it up. It's like a stick. It's like, like... That's a cream one. <laughs> I'll go with the powdered ones, because the other ones just don't make sense to me. <laughs> okay. That works. Okay, what in... That's, that's what... <laughs> no difference. <laughs> well, you picked two that are similar. Oh, there we go. This is a different color. Okay. I mean, you He's contemplating. Mac. This one looks. This one's never been used. The Mac one? Are you serious? I use that all the time. Look, there's there's no. There's a huge indent in it. But there's no like crusties anywhere. Well. <laughs> okay, you're going with Mac. 
Going with Mac. All right. Mac's a good brand. I feel like these all, you know, what we got like. Yeah. It's coinciding. Do you want to go with the, the blue? Right you right? want me to? Use, I was going to ask you. Blue, right? I was actually going to ask you if you wanted any specific colors for me to use, but I was going to do it later. I mean, I think these go together. Yeah. Pretty close. Uh huh. Wait, which one? Yeah, keep that, please. Are these the same? No. Is this the one different? Do There's, I need this? Yes, you need that. <laughs> these were these. Those were, yep, those are the blushes. You can put those away. Okay, so, so far we have foundation and mascara setting highlight blush. So I still need a bronzer and a concealer and a primer. I thought it was done. <laughs> I mean, you can be if you want. I guess I can just are you use... Are going to take out, like, some brushes? No, I mean, you can, but no, I'm just going to use my own brushes. Sorry. <laughs> okay, so the bronzer drawer is one... Yeah, go one down. That's bronzer. What's this? Oh, bronzer. Oh, I think you said... You can pick one of those. It's got everything in it if you want, but then you got to put the blush... Well, you don't have to put the blush and highlight back, but... Can't they just make, like, a... <gasps> saying i just heard you little meow you say dad pick the makeup <laughs> color effects cover cover the powder fell out of that one here, you need a bronzer okay stick <laughs> i'm gonna help you out honey stick to like these back here they're my single bronzers those are all like palettes and you already have blush and highlight so i don't need that wait so you can just buy one thing that has all of this yeah and not to buy them all separately yeah but you also do have to i yeah you need more than just that Waste. It's not a waste. I'm gonna shut this again. I keep like seeing myself in the background. Oh. I don't like it. Bronzer? That's Bronzer, weird. yep. Where does this go? Like on my cheeks right here and like around my forehead to not look like a pale ghost. The okay. highlight well, goes. This was that. Yeah, it goes on top of the bronzer. The blush and the bronzer and the highlight all go on my cheeks. How many layers are we talking Butter about? Butterscotch. Stop it. All yeah. right, let's get a couple of these out. <laughs> oh my gosh, honey. Okay, this one. This video is gonna be an hour long. Well, you can cut it down. I, I'm not cutting any of this out. It's funny. <laughs> I have pan in both those. That's how much I love both of them. That's a big deal to get pan in something like that. Oh, I, I hear I hear all about the pan. Yeah. We'll go with this one. Oh, bougie. Charlotte That's Tilbury. That's a bougie one. That one was $55, but I got it on sale. I got it on sale for 20% off, okay? <laughs> all right. Um. So, yeah, okay, you can pick a settings, right? I do need that. He's like, are you serious? <laughs> Bougie again. All right, all right. No, you don't need anything in there. You already got a lip. Okay, so I need a primer, which is up here, and then a concealer, and I think I'm good. So this is your base coat? Yeah, <laughs> this is my base coat, yes. <laughs> this oh, sets the tone for my makeup. Does this have color in it? No, it doesn't have color. It's like, nor a lot of them are hydrating because I have dry skin. Hydrating. Hydrating. Hydrochloric acid. <laughs> That's not what it says. <laughs> It's like jello. Uh huh. Oh, okay, sir. He's like, I don't want to pick. Which one do you want? <laughs> Let a butterscotch pick one. This is like husband and cat picks my makeup at the same time. Do you like any of these? <laughs> what? No, no, no. Not that one? Okay. We're going to go with this because, like, this is goofy. Okay. I don't know what that can be good for. All right. I think the only other thing I need is a concealer, which are all in there they're all the same color it's kind of like foundation but i need well i guess i don't need both but like i want both is this foundation that's foundation you know, yeah. say, like, this i, is the I know honey it's just the steps they just, they just put it in a different bot like <laughs> little thing, and they sell it twice probably like, oh, probably yeah, we'll never notice. it's probably a gimmick but here we are let's go with a little date we don't have anything small Let's okay i like light that too vanilla. yeah mars. i'm a vanilla nars. girl nars mars <laughs> but we have five things of the same color <laughs> Uh -huh. Is that, I think that's it. I think that's it too, honey. I think you picked a full face of makeup for me. Okay, question really quick. With the eyeshadow palette, are there any specific shades you want me to use? Or can I just have free reign? You tell me. That's a pretty colorful palette. You, I can have free reign. I can make whatever I want then if you don't want to pick a color. That's fine. What's to say you have to incorporate a color? Well, okay. Let's go with... Which one? It's got to go with a hard one, right? <sighs> I mean, I guess. <laughs> Is this black? Like, can you do that? I can use that if you want me to. Let's, let's go with one. Let's go with the, the green. The green? Okay. I have to incorporate the green right here? Yeah. Okay. I can do that. All right. Well, cool. Thanks for helping pick my makeup. I'm going to apply it all, and then I'll bring you back in when I'm done so you can see the look you created. Okay? Exciting. Butterscotch says, let me help, too. Definitely not ready for husband puts my makeup on. Yeah, that's fine. I understand. I know. It's a lot. It's a lot. That's it's a, a lot. lot of coats. 
Like and subscribe if you want Mike to do my makeup one day. <laughs> uh, we'll see. All right, thanks, babe. Love you. Love you. <laughs> Is he not the cutest thing ever? I love him so much. So, as you saw, I had to coax him and guide him a little tiny bit. If not, you guys, I would have had like three makeup products to choose from and like I would have had to do a whole face with like three or four items because he just doesn't know, which is totally fine. He's a guy. He doesn't know anything about makeup. But I just realized he chose a red lip and a peach blush and he wants me to use a green eyeshadow. So this shall be interesting. For eyeshadow palette, he chose the Pat McGrath Labs Mothership Mega Celestial Odyssey. He definitely chose this solely on the fact that he liked the packaging and the colors inside. So he kind of gave me free reign. The only thing he wants me to incorporate is this green right here. And we are gonna incorporate that green right there. If that's what he wants, that's what he's gonna get. So first I'm going to start off with this light brown shade and put it in my crease. The very first video I did for Vlogmas a couple weeks ago was a red and green makeup look tutorial with green eyes and red lips and apparently we are recreating that today. <laughs> Alright now that we have that buffed out into the crease we're going to put NYX glitter primer all over my lid and I figure I would do a little bit of a halo eye today. I think I'm going to use that green shade on the outer and inner portion and then this really pretty like champagne-y shade in the middle. I told him last night at dinner that I was curious to see what eyeshadow palette he was going to choose and I didn't say this part but I was curious because I didn't know if he was going to choose the Huda Beauty Mercury Retrograde palette because that is the only piece of makeup he's ever bought for me. He surprised me and bought it for me like a year and a half ago at this point and I wasn't sure if he was going to see it and be like oh that's the one I bought let me have her use that. I honestly just don't think he saw it. And I think he saw this packaging of the Pat McGrath palette and was like, yeah, that's cool. <laughs> so packaging really does sell makeup, guys. It really does. <laughs> We're going to pack this shade in the middle. Ooh, that's pretty. But I didn't say that to him because I didn't want to like sway his choice and have him remember that palette and then pick it. You know what I mean? Uh, but maybe I'll say it to him afterwards. Like, why didn't you pick that one? I really just don't think he saw it or remembered that even owned it. I have a lot of eyeshadow palettes. He was probably so overwhelmed. <laughs> then I'm gonna take a little baby brush and we're going to take this deep brown shade and put that into my crease. Deepen up the crease a little bit. Buff that out with the light brown. I am getting fallout from those shades, but it's fine. And then I kind of want to add like a wing. So I'm gonna take a flat definer brush and that dark brown matte and we're just going to stamp it here. I think I'm gonna create a little baby wing with it. Well, that got bigger than I expected, but that's okay. <laughs> okay, I think that's where we're gonna leave the eyes there for now. I'm gonna go do the other eye and then we'll be moving on to the face. For primer, he chose the Milk Hydro Grip Primer. I've only used this one time and it was during my Sephora sale try on video and I did not love it. So we're going to give it a go again today. Honestly, it's probably a good thing he chose it because I don't know when I would have given it another go without him choosing it. I definitely think that that is a fault of mine if I try something and I really don't like it. Um, I, it takes like, I don't want to try it again. <laughs> so we're just, we're going to give this another go today. I'm going to really pat it in. A couple things why I sit here and let that Hydro Grip primer really sink into my skin. I heard that that is a tip for it to just really give it a minute or two to sink in. Um, one, my face is covered in sparkles right now. These shadows are having quite a bit of fallout. And two, I realized he did not pick any brow products. So that's fun. I guess I will just um, probably mix together the two brown shades from the palette and use that. That was totally an error on my judgment. I didn't even realize that he didn't pick brow products, but that's okay. For foundation, he chose the Believe Beauty Skin Finish Foundation. I have the shade Linen. So, I really liked this foundation a while ago, but I did use it in a video kind of recently, I feel like. Or maybe it wasn't a video. No, I think it was. Um, and I didn't love how it looked on my skin that time that I used it. So, I used to really enjoy this foundation, but like I said, I didn't like it the last time I used it. So, we shall see what it does today, especially with this primer. <laughs> I'm intrigued to see how it performs. All right, so I got that foundation all blended out. I am not loving how it looks on my skin. I think it's a double combination of not loving that primer and then this foundation just, I don't know. I just feel like it's drying. It doesn't give me like the most full coverage. It's just kind of like sitting on my skin a little bit weirdly, but that's okay. 
For a concealer, he chose the NARS Soft Matte Complete Concealer in the shade Light 2 Vanilla. I'm actually really glad he chose this only because I feel like I talk about in videos talking about this product that I have used it on my under eyes in the past and I really like it that way, but I've never showed that on camera before. So today we're gonna show me applying it under my eyes. So how I like to use it is I just get some on my finger and I just like to tap it in. I only used this on my under eyes when we were on vacation over the last summer, um, but I like weirdly did my makeup completely with my hands. Oh, that'll be fun to blend out. I like weirdly did my makeup only with my hands when we were on vacation. It was very weird. I like never do my makeup with my hands, but I was like at the beach and like doing not super crazy makeup. And so I just was blending everything out with my hands and my fingers. So. That's how I used it. So I've never blended out with a sponge, but we're gonna try it today. Okay, so I definitely do think it works better blending it out with your fingers. I'm just gonna tap it in. Also, I feel like the concealer is a little bit deeper than the foundation. And my redness is just peeking through. I mean, my cheeks were really red to begin with, but yeah, this foundation is not really giving me a whole bunch of coverage. So for powder, he chose the e.l.f. Halo Glow Setting Powder. I actually really do like this powder. I typically don't use it to set under my eyes, but we're going to do it today because that is the only powder he chose. <laughs> you know, not my best base day. Not my best base day, but that's okay. For bronzer, he chose the Charlotte Tilbury Airbrush Bronzer. I have the shade 2 Medium. He went bougie with the bronzer because this is an expensive bronzer but it's also one of my favorites so i was really happy to see him choose this for highlight he chose the juvia's place the tribe highlighter volume three this is one of my favorite highlighters ever it is so stunning and so blinding you will see you from mars when you wear this highlight but i love it so i was not upset when he chose this highlight blinding and beautiful it is on sale right now at the juvia's places website and it's not available on ulta anymore which is where i picked mine up no i got this from their website um a while ago when they were doing a sale but anyways it was it used to be available at ulta and now it's not and like i said it's been on sale on the juvia's place website so i really hope they're not discontinuing it that would be a shame because this is beautiful and there's three different shades so you can find one that matches your skin tone i just highlighted that zit on my forehead probably shouldn't have done that probably should have skipped that area all right, you would have seen it anyways. <laughs> then for blush, he chose the MAC Peaches blush. He said that this looked like it had never been used. What is he talking about? There's like a huge dent in it. I don't know if you guys can see. Um, okay, you definitely cannot see. Can you see there? There's like a huge dent. I love this blush. I've had it for years. I use it all the time, but that's okay. That's okay. Um, would I normally pair a peach blush with this eye look and a red lipstick? No. Mm -mm. Nope. But that's okay. I am glad he chose this because it is a really beautiful blush and I really do like it. So for brows, I'm just going to mix together these two brown shades to try to get a semi-decent brow shade for myself since I did not have him, ooh, no, okay. Since I did not have him choose a brow product. Oh gosh, that is so intense, holy moly. Ooh, well, that did not end up like I wanted it to. Okay, I don't like that. I would probably never, ever, ever do this again, but in a pinch, did I have a choice? Okay, I would never fill my eyebrows in with those powders ever again, ever, but that's okay. You know what, we're making it work. Um, I did just go ahead and finish up the eyes. I used that lighter brown under my lower lash line, and then I used my highlight as my inner corner and brow bone highlight. Next up for a mascara, he chose the Essence Lash Princess Foss Lash Effect. Not my favorite mascara in the world. However, it has been growing on me. The first like one or two times I used it, I did not like it at all. But the last couple of times I've used it, it's not the worst. I mean, I would definitely choose my Tarte Man Eater or like the Rare Beauty Mascara over this one. But I think he just liked the green, honestly. <laughs> Then for lipstick, he chose one from ColourPop. This was from like their Disney princesses themed lipsticks that they released honestly a while ago. This is pretty old. This is in the shade Snow White. It is red. Mm -hmm. No lip liner, nothing. Green eye, red lip, peach cheeks. Okay. 
That's Bright Bold uh, Red Lip. Yep, sure is. Alrighty. Last up for setting spray, he chose the Charlotte Tilbury Airbrush Flawless Setting Spray. I love this setting spray. It's such a good one. I think that's why he chose it. It was just on top. And he was like, fine, I'll just pick this. <laughs> And here is the final look with all of the makeup that my husband chose for me. Let me get you a little up closer look of the eye look. Is it the worst makeup ever? No. Would I ever really have paired hardly any of these products together? Probably not. Mm -mm. Although, you know what? This lip is actually really stunning. I actually really like the lip color a lot. I don't, I definitely wouldn't have paired it with this eye look, but I'm gonna have to like pull that out and wear it more often. That's like really pretty. Um, and yeah, and I actually do really like this eye look. I love that green shade. So I was fine with him telling me to use the green shade. It's just with the peach cheeks and the red lips. It was just a little much. But it's Christmassy. I think that's what he was going for. I think that's what he wanted. A nice Christmas inspired look because it's coming up in a couple of days. So yeah, let's um, call him in and see what he thinks. Looks good. Yeah. Looks like Christmassy. It, it's very Christmassy. Do you want to get a frame? I don't know how you're going no. to. You're so tall. <laughs> there you go. You like it? It looks good. See, I think yeah. I did perfect. I mean, obviously the the selection was on par. I can totally tell I picked the best products because it looks so much better. No, but for real. Oh, no, it looks good. Do you really like yeah, it? Yeah. Do you like the base? Does my skin look good? I'm guessing it's supposed <laughs> to not, but it looks fine. I mean, it looks good, yeah. What do you think of the eye look I made with the green? I like it. Uh, what's up with the, the middle thing? Is that like a look? Yeah, it's like a halo eye. Oh, did you I want see. me to put the green over the there's, whole thing? There's no wings. I did put wings. What are you talking about? Oh, little tiny. Like, I know. The big oh, ones. you wanted big ones? Okay. Well, the little wings didn't suffice, I mean, guys. I, I, I like the <laughs> lipstick with it. It looks you do? good. You see? Do? I was worried you were, you were acting like it wasn't going to match or something. I mean, but it's don't like you... real bright, bright red with like green. That's, you like that's it? what people go for. Is it though? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Well, thank you for picking my makeup. Looks, I appreciate looks it. Looks good. Should I kiss you so I get some of the lipstick <laughs> on? <laughs> Perfect. Perfect. Love it, love it. Look, it's perfect. <laughs> oh, shoot. <clears throat> what, did I mess it all up? Yeah, that's all right. This is what happened on our wedding day. Well, I got... you fix mine? <laughs> Beautiful red lips. I need some like, green eyeshadow, and I'm right there with you. I could do the... Put I do your husband's makeup. That's a thing too. Or I do your makeup. Mm -hmm. I mean, that's fine. Like and subscribe if you want to see that. <laughs> and that was it, you guys. That was the husband picks my makeup challenge. What do you think? Let me know down below in the comments. Did he do good? I think he did. I really like this look. Let me know. Do you want to see this handsome man on the <laughs> channel more often? Because I would love that. <laughs> if you made it to the end of this video, thank you so much. You're awesome. I love you. Please subscribe if you have not yet. And I will see you tomorrow in my next video. Bye, guys. Bye. <laughs>